Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman, in a bid to accelerate the EV transition, has announced that the government would be unveiling a battery swapping policy soon. Now, simply put, battery swapping is a concept whereby an electric vehicle user can exchange his drain battery with a charged one instead of charging it himself. Electric vehicles come with both swappable and fixed batteries. Charging an electric vehicle with a regular charging unit can take up to six to eight hours, and a fast charger can take up to 60 minutes. But at a battery swapping station, a customer can simply exchange his battery and start driving rather than waiting for the vehicle to be charged. And yes, the government is in advanced stages of formulating this policy. It could come up in the next uh, two to three months. They're also considering setting standards for the battery size and connector. There will be no standards for battery chemistry as the government wants to encourage innovation in this space. Sources tell CNBC TV 18 that interoperability standards will first be laid down for electric two-wheelers in the first phase and then in the next phase for uh, electric three-wheelers and electric buses as well. Currently, there are no plans to bring four-wheelers under the battery swapping policy. Industry sources have been telling CNBC TV 18 that electric three-wheeler owners will benefit most from battery swapping. Now, as far as financial support goes, certain states do give subsidies for electric vehicle swapping stations, but the central government does not. Sources tell CNBC TV 18 that the outlay for battery swapping could come from the FAME scheme. Also very crucial for the policy would be clarity on the goods and services tax, whether GST on batteries and swapping will be reduced from 18% to 5%. Currently, if you buy an electric vehicle with a battery, then you pay a GST of just 5%. And if you buy a standalone battery, then that would uh, get you a GST of 18%. The government believes that a battery swapping policy could encourage battery subscriptions, maybe even home delivery of batteries in future. The upfront cost for the customer may also come down as he would always uh, not have to buy the battery with the vehicle, which is 40% of the electric vehicle's cost. And uh, there are several startups in this space, including Sun Mobility, Bounce, and Lithium Power. Big industrial houses also see a big opportunity here. Honda has recently invested in battery swapping stations in India. Hero Motor Corp and Gogoro will be setting up a network of swapping stations. Reliance and Adani Electricity are keen to be big players in this space. And you also have Tata Power and Amara Raja who have launched pilot projects to test the battery swapping market.